Okay, let's do another example. Okay, so I'm going to read this. This is HVAC example. It says, a square hot air duct must have the same area as two rectangular ones with dimensions 5 by 8 inches and 4 by 6 inches. How long are the sides of the square duct? Okay, great. Okay, so we've got a square duct. Right? So we've got a square duct here. And then we've got two other rectangular ducts. Okay, and what do we know about the two rectangular ones? Well, we know the dimensions. 5 by 8, 4 by 6. Okay, and they're both in inches. Okay, now we know that these two areas add up to this one, very similar to the one that we did earlier. So we'll call this area 1, we'll call this area 2, and we'll call this area 3. So we know that area 3 equals area 1 plus area 2. Okay, now we want to find the length of the side of this air duct. Well, first of all, we know that the area A3 is equal to S squared. Okay? So we know S squared has to equal the sum of these two areas. So that means S squared has to equal what? 8 times 5 plus 6 times 4, right? Because both of these are length times width, length times width. And so what do I get? I get S squared has to equal what? 40 plus 24, which equals 64. So S has to equal the square root of 64, which equals 8 inches. So we know the length of one of the sides of the square duct is 8 inches. Have a great day.